we are going to make a silly flake uh, sambal. To make the silly flake sambal, uh, obviously we have uh, silly flakes and the onion, we are going to the garlic and uh, lemon juice and in addition to the lemon juice, the normal soy sauce and also sweet soy sauce. This is the very good um, condiment that we make it uh, uh, and uh, so we use it with the rice and various other dishes uh, that we use it. I like it when the people like it a little bit of spicier, hotter and with the need some heat they can you know use this one others don't have to do that what we are going to do is you know we are going to temper this the chili flakes then after temper that and with other ingredient then we will grind them to make it a uh, um, light uh, in a paste that's the way we are going to make this uh, um, uh, tangy hot and heat uh, uh, chili flake sambal now we are going to um, temper the uh, chili uh, flakes and what we do is you know we just uh, uh, at the low heat make it uh, uh, temper you will hear in some sneezing and <laughs> something like that hope it will not be the case and we'll see how that is going to go so now we are going to add a uh, one teaspoon of oil once we uh, roasted that uh, uh, off so now we are turn off the so once you add that with the oil, you can see that you know how the <coughs> silly blades is uh, coming along. <coughs> this is a great one for all the uh, silly lovers, uh, hot and spicy lovers. Very good one. Good for the biryani. Good for the plain rice. <coughs> good for the string of a. Good for anything. I love it. Now we are going to add the chili flake, tempered chili flake into the blender cup and then we will uh, blend it uh, with uh, uh, onion and garlic and then we have the other soy sauce and other things so they will become very uh, tasty and of course you know we need to add the salt salt is important for the sambal and then what we are doing is now adding the, the lemon juice so lemon juice uh, will create a little bit of uh, moist to that uh, dry chili flakes and also add the tangy uh, uh, flavor to that and uh, so that's uh, we have nicely temper the silly flakes that's very important you don't make it uh, you know too dark otherwise then it will become very dark and you don't uh, get that uh, the real taste of the uh, silly uh, and uh, then what we are doing is uh, we are adding the soy sauce this is uh, part of uh, adding that uh, little bit of moisture. Then also we are going to add the sweet soy sauce. So earlier we had the normal sweet soy sauce is thicker than the uh, normal soy sauce. And uh, 
they are both are two different consistencies and now we are adding the garlic uh, cloves that we have prepared and just slightly mix them so that you know, when you blend it you know, they become uh, so only thing you may have noticed that we didn't add the onion yet we will add the onion after in you know, a blending so <coughs> blending it for a long time uh, to uh, piece see cut. that in you know, how that uh, looking great that's a way that we make this uh, silly flake cut sambal and we are still going to add the onion we are going to add the onion uh, so the reason that we are adding the onion later is so that you know you get the, the crunchy uh, a bite uh, of the sambal uh, or taste of the sambal with the uh, um, uh, chili. That is the end process of the uh, chili flake uh, hot sambal that uh, go with any um, Indian Sri Lankan dishes that uh, we prepare from Italy, dosa, rice and biryani, name anything, put to um, and like that and this is especially for uh, people who really like the spicy and hot and heat and uh, not for everyone I love it I like it and I only you take a little bit of so this one will last for about six months and the, the final touch and final color and the brilliant colors yes I think the, the red color very nice already mouth watering and um, yes that is a beautiful silly flake sambal that we have just made it the sambal will last for at least you know six months you take only the little bit uh, whenever you want it is it is used only as a condiment it is not a dish and so that you know we use it for over the months and this is very spicy as you can see our ingredient very hot dried red the chili flakes has been used and we added the onion and chilies and the uh, uh, aroma is fantastic the color is great thank you very much for watching this fantastic uh, uh, heat uh, uh, driven um, chili flake sambal so now we have put the sambal into the jar and the uh, air tight and we can keep it and use it at least for a six month and um, by the way I would like to mention that this wrap is our own nobody nobody make this sambal anywhere in the world and because this is uh, uniquely made this hot sambal uh, I will be sharing the recipe in my you know uh, post uh, YouTube post and try to make this one and make it an excellent choice of yours and I'm sure you will love it thank you very much for watching this uh, brilliant uh, chili flake um, hot and spicy sambal and uh, appreciate your subscription to our youtube channel thank you